swear they trashed the bedroom on purpose. We're probably getting a search warrant to search your place right now. Well, they won't be able to find anything, so all we're gonna have to do is wait. You know, we're gonna have to let the cops make the next move. Just be glad that they're not gonna blame you for Dante's shooting. Okay, the, the christening was the perfect alibi. Yeah, but when Sonny disappears, they're gonna be all over me. They'll know that I'm involved. They're not gonna be able to prove anything. You know, to set bail, Sonny and I had to put up all our legitimate assets. So when Sonny skips, he's gonna lose his house. And I could possibly lose this place. Because no matter what you lose, you're not going to lose me. Obviously, this is all very confusing. I'm not even sure who knows what or where to begin. Well, we know that Dominic is an undercover cop named Dante Falconeri, and he's our dad's son. And that Uncle Sonny shot him. You know what? This is all a little too much for everybody, I think, to deal with. But Uncle Sonny is innocent until proven guilty, right? Then maybe this entire situation with Dante is just a big mistake. Generally speaking, in law, if you kill someone, even if they're extenuating circumstances, whether it's an accident or a mistake, there are consequences, and sometimes they can be really tough. Well, it sounds like the less we say about all this, the better. I really don't know what to say, and I certainly can't offer any more oh, advice uh, about Sonny. What I will tell you is that It's okay to love Sonny and hate what he does. He's done terrible things. But no matter what, he loves you. And there isn't anybody in this room that he wouldn't give up his life for. If Diane gets bail, you need to disappear before you're charged with Dante's shooting. I can't just shoot one of my kids and walk away. Okay, you know what? If Dante dies, you will be charged with first-degree murder. And it's not fair to put the rest of your children through a trial like that. If he lives, you'll still be charged with shooting him on top of Claudia's murder. What if Michael confesses to save you, Sonny? It will destroy his life. If you disappear, Claudia's murder is shelved. Michael knows that you're okay, and eventually you can see him again. You're just seeing what you want to see, okay. just like I did. Dominic came to Port Charles to shut you down. Right. He's still a cop. Mm -hmm. The FBI already has enough information to take you down. I don't care. i got to figure out a way to make this right for Dante and for Michael. But you know what? If Diane gets bail, you disappear. You get one shot and you take it. I don't care what it costs and I don't care how you feel. And sometimes, Sonny, and you're lucky to be getting out alive. I know. I believe in you. And I know you love your children. So I know you're going to do the right thing. I never wanted you to know who your father was. Try from the start to get you off this case. Why did you just tell me the truth? I should have. I should have told you as soon as I saw you sitting on that couch when I walked into my apartment and you told me, you told me that you were here to bust Sonia. I should have told you. I need to know who my father was. But you've seen up close what Sonny's kids have to deal with. Honey, I didn't want that life for you. I knew that even when I was 15 years old. Maybe that part of your life, I wouldn't do any different. You did not need to grow up Sonny Corinthos's kid. Who all knows? I'm Connie. She's known from the start. That's why you and I were fighting so much. Yeah. 
Who else? Jax. Patrick Drake. <sighs> the other day, when everything started closing in, um, I went to Agent Rainer at the FBI. And I told him that Sonny was your father. And that that was a clear conflict of interest that would get the case thrown out. I told him that I would tell the truth if he didn't take you off the case. And he said he would. He said I didn't have anything to worry about. Yeah, well, Agent Rainer is a liar. But then so are you. <laughs>